Good morning. It's 3.59 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, Tuesday, February 4th. And now the light coin news. I've been up prior to an hour of this, and I noted that the market maker was bringing down uh, the price. And I made that video. It's about an hour long. I've been watching the market for an hour, and I knew he was going to bring it down. And now it's down, people. How am I able to find that out? There's two trades, 1588.90. I found him before. He actually transitioned his numbers from 1593.90 to new 1588.90. Okay. Now let's see the other side. Look how far his his buy trade is, and look where his sell trade is. That's obvious signs that he's uh using the two one of the two largest trades in the order book to leverage the price down the 1588.90 I suspect that this is his trade too this trade has been responsible for helping him dump down it's the wee morning hours that's when he likes to bring the price down so nobody catches him doing what he's doing when we started before an hour ago this was at sixty nine dollars I have the video it's about an hour long. I don't think you guys want to watch an hour long video. But if anybody wants to, just put it in the comments field. I'll put it up. So, okay, let's go over the numbers. I, I know you're going to see numbers where this is out of whack. 68.22. I know it's going to be out of whack. I mean, who are we kidding here, people? We all know what's going on. 50 cents. Let's go to the bottom. Look how far this one is. 67.06. I rest my case. Well, how, how hard was that to prove that he's driving down the price? And I think what he's doing now, he's adding additional trades in there to help him push down the price, people. I'm so I'm sorry. I started this actually about two o'clock in the morning, and uh, I, I observed it for a whole hour, from uh, two to three. Unfortunately, that video was an hour long, where we actually started from the beginning, where he transitioned his uh market size from 1593.90 to 1588.90 spot 90. the market size if you go check you'll see that now there's two trades of that 1588 spot 90 uh, and what happened is I noticed he was bringing it down the numbers were out of whack like this and I stood by to watch him actually have an effect on the market and it, and it did bring it down so that confirms it. That's just another video I got for the archive because that one's an hour long. These guys are rigging the market. Every scumbag that's in here is on this exchange. Whether you know it or not, you are a scumbag because this exchange is robbing people. And the market maker is taking his, using his trades to leverage the price to a desired effect. And now I'm suspecting I see the trades that are used to manipulate the market. They're stacked together with the market maker's trades, you see? That's the market maker's trades. We identified that. And then you see a trade about the same size now, pushing down to the mid-market price and driving it price down. Uh, the other trade is, is uh, 1588.90. Is... I seen it, it's probably out of sight now, it's so low. I either way when we found it, it's still out of whack. More than ten percent. Uh let's let's see how how much out of whack it is. Twenty five percent. That's an awful lot. And look, look how precise. See what a bot does? It's 25% uh, buys to the downside. 
That's how he leveraged it. That's how he's moving the trade, the mid-market price. That's how he's he's getting, forcing you people to dump. He's triggering your stop losses, and he's triggering your bots to start dumping, to take profit. You see, look where the 1588.90 is. That's 67.14. Right down there. It's, it's, it's so far down the ladder, 67.14. Right? Now it's even... You can't even see it on the exposed order book. And then you go to his other trade. Look where it, look, you can see it by just scrolling up. There it is. Look how close. Where the USD spread, that's where you can consider where the mid-market price is. Look where this trade is. And the other one is so far, far down the, the price level on the buy side, you can no longer see it. It's at 67.14. And then these idiots are going to try to tell you, you don't know what you're talking about. If I don't know what I'm talking about, let's go get a bunch of people, say, from Fordham. You see, it's down 67.14, just like I told you. Let's get a bunch of people who understand how leverage works and how an order book is, and we'll put them in an audience, and we'll go up on stage or with the screen, and I'll show them this, and you tell me how many of those people are going to agree with you. I'll tell you, and how many. Zero, unless they're your friend. Okay, unless you stack the audience, you know, that old trick, put your buddies in the front and have them clap. And then when the rest of the tards behind them see them, well, uh, they all start clapping too. Crowd dynamics. I already had a professor from Fordham University look at this, okay? These guys are thieves. They're criminals. They're criminals. You're trading on an exchange run by criminals. There's no way they can say that I haven't told them, exposed this to them. I got two years. They got tired of me calling them. Two years of phone calls. Two years of opening cases. Two years of sending them certified letters. And then their laws. Well, if anybody's caught manipulating the price, we'll take appropriate action. You've done nothing. 6714. As far as you can go on the order book. Look. Look where the, look where your market makers trade is leveraged at. You friggin' punks. And then you come on this side. That's right, you're thieves. And look where your other trade is. This is where your mid market price is with USD spread is. This is the center of the fulcrum. Look how far you are. It's like a seesaw. If you put one person to, to closer to the fulcrum, you're going to move the seesaw out of balance. You're going to change the fulcrum. Man, you people better get up in arms and get off your ass. These people are actively ripping you off. This is a tree card Monty fucking scam. And then, you ever see a tree card Monty scam? They'll have a black guy doing the, the shifting, and there's some pretty white girl. So you can, you say, well, that can't be. You disassociate, they'll ever possibly work together. But they are, and the girl keeps winning and going, yay, win again. The stupid, dim-witted girl, the pretty girl, keeps winning. Surely you can win, and then you go over there and you get ripped off. Meanwhile, it doesn't go into your mind that... The guy shuffling the cards is working with the person because their races are different. You think in polarized thought, and they got you. This is what this is. You're thinking in polarized thought. Not Charlie Lee, not the exchange. They're on the up and up. Anybody who believes that the exchange would be involved in such a thing has got to be nuts. They understand these principles. They use them against you. I'm not the one that uh, who, uh, I, I identified the trades, but I'm not the one who told you that uh, how the trades are supposed to be used. Coinbase told you, and then when you go to check it, it's it's not being they're not being used that way. All right, people, this really pisses me off. And then these goons have. 
the goons, the Litecoin squad, the goons, the Litecoin goons, I like to call them, come in here and try to threaten me. They're going to take my YouTube channel down. It's still here, isn't it, you goons, you dummies, you fucking cheap punks. Punks, that's what you are, you thieving punks. You probably don't even know what the, the person who sent you in here to take my channel down, what's doing. You're working for a crook, you idiots. Dummies. Low-level dummies. Used used like a friggin' coaster. Put your drink on top of it, dummies. Let the people manipulate you, dummies. Like they manipulate the market. They're manipulating you, you dummies. I'm out of here.